Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 Edition. Page 547. Lung and Chest Wall. Describe the physiologic state of the lung and chest wall at FRC or at resting stage. So at FRC, you have just completed a normal expiration. At this point, there is the tendency for the lungs to collapse inward and for the chest wall to spring outward. So at FRC, the inward pull of the lung is balanced by the outward pull of the chest wall, and the system pressure at this point is atmospheric. Also, at FRC, the airway and alveolar pressures are at zero. The intrapleural pressures at this point are negative, and the reason for this negative intrapleural pressure is to keep the airways open and to prevent pneumothorax. What is pulmonary compliance? Pulmonary compliance is the change in lung volume for a given change in pressure. What does low pulmonary compliance indicate? Low pulmonary compliance indicates a stiff lung, which means extra work for the lung to bring in normal volume of air. What are some conditions that would lead to decrease in lung compliance? The conditions that would lead to decrease in lung compliance include pulmonary fibrosis, pneumonia, and pulmonary edema. What does an increase in lung compliance indicate? An increase in lung compliance indicates that the elastic tissue of the lung has been damaged. Name some situations that would lead to an increase in compliance. An increase in compliance will happen in emphysema and with normal aging. Briefly, describe the picture on your screen. The picture on your screen just basically mentions everything we have already talked about, which means that at FRC, there is a tendency for the lung to collapse inward and the chest wall to spring outward, and that center point is the atmospheric pressure. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.